Okay, so this video is going to be about the time evolution operator. And what that is, is something that will allow us to not have to solve the Schrodinger equation. It'll make things much simpler for us. So I'm going to derive, and I'm doing air quotes when I say that, derive the uh, time evolution operator by basically solving, again, air quotes, solving the Schrodinger equation kind of it generally. And the way I'm going to do that is by assuming or by treating my state kit here as a function of time and treat it just like any other function of time. So what I'm going to do is divide both sides of this equation by the state kit. And I get this. And then I just do what I would normally do if this were some function is I'm going to integrate both sides. So I'll integrate this side from psi equals psi of 0 to psi equals psi of t, and integrate the right side from 0 to t. And if I do that, then what I'll what I would get is the natural logarithm. This is you know d d thing over thing. That's natural logarithm of uh, this minus natural logarithm of that, which you know property of natural logs. That's natural log of psi of t over psi of zero. And if I uh, exponentiate both sides, I get this, and then I can just multiply over my state ket. So what I end up with is this expression. So again, a little bit of a shady derivation, but this is, uh, what is this telling me? This is, this is saying that to get my state ket as a function of time, what I can do is apply this operator to my initial state ket. And as opposed to solving the Schrodinger equation. And you can notice that if, if the Hamiltonian is time independent, then I can pull it out of this integral and I'll just have the integral from zero to t of dt, which is just t. So in that case, my operator uh, simplifies a little bit. So this is, uh, you know, the key, the important part of this video is uh, these are the expressions. This is the most more general expression for the time evolution operator uh, that we'll use. And it'll be much simpler for solving problems than, you, than uh, solving the Schrodinger equation most of the time. 